point of view. Oh, yes. Must be. Must be, and it is. Scotland are in desperate straits. Ian Phillip has gone. LBW to Mondral Islam. He's wrapped the pads a few times. It's the second LBW. And Scotland are eight for three. Stanger and Salmon, new at the crease. That's a fine shot. That's 4 to George Salmond. And the first boundary of the Scotland innings. This is indeed a good shot by Salmon. Ball is wide, he's overpitched. With a nice balanced position. That's just over, and four runs from the bat of George Salmond. Another wide delivery, George Salmond square cuts, but it goes very near to the fielder. It's just over the top of the left hand, oh, very close. And again, and that's a better shot. That's along the ground, in the gap, consecutive boundaries to George Salmon. That's gone. The gully's done the trick for Bangladesh. Forcing shot from George Salmon and after two boundaries in the over, he pays the price for not getting over the top of the ball. Wonderful catch. That's the way that he plays, heaving up in his half, and that's a front foot player, lovely way to start, four runs to the second ball that he faces. Very short straight boundary, pretty good shot from Nathan Astor, not out the middle of the bat, but with a nice straight bat, he just turned the face at the last minute, and that might have been to place it straight past the bowler rather than hit it to mid-off. Wasn't at the dead centre, but enough to get him four. And he's gone. Mondoral, the young teenager playing in his first World Cup game, has got Astle out. Just a little bit of overconfidence, angling it across the right-hander. And he misread the pace of that one. It just didn't come onto the bat. He struck it pretty well, but directly... To mid off. Well, it certainly typifies the way Nathan, Nathan Aspel plays. Doesn't get his front foot anywhere near the ball and just clubbed it really to mid off. And had it been a meter either side, it would have been four more. And so he goes. So that's a very good breakthrough there for Bangladesh. Craig McMillan coming in at number three for New Zealand. Again, another very attacking player. Likes to dominate the bowlers. Doesn't like to be tied down. Munter Islam has picked up that first wicket. Nathan Astor perhaps just giving his wicket away, really. Munter to McMillan. And the bowl again. And perhaps see New Zealand batsman just a little bit free, a little bit loose. Maybe they think it's just too easy out there. But this new ball does a bit. You have to be careful here in New Zealand. It's not a very big target. But if you lose one or two wickets... And that is not a good play from Craig McMillan. He's that type of player that likes to dominate at the same stage. If you keep playing like that, you can just surrender your wicket as well. Nathan Astle's already done that. Mondoril just a little bit wide, but it all just, just came back a little bit off the seam and went between the bat and pad. The shot, and uh, that typifies again the approach of uh, Craig McMillan, who doesn't like to be dictated to.